police chief. This week, tensions came to a head as the city board of directors tabled a vote of no confidence in the chief. And now we're hearing from officers about their take on this discord. Our Susan L. Corey sat down with the department's two biggest groups who have different takes on the situation. The majority of officers who work here are either members of the Fraternal Order of Police, the Black Police Officers Association, or both. Today, I talked to leadership who stand divided when it comes to the police chief, but agree something has to give. The same badge is on every Little Rock police officer's uniform, but there's a clear line that's been drawn when it comes to Chief Keith Humphrey. Give him a fair chance. This is ridiculous. We do have some concerns. Uh, uh, we're not going to comment on any kind of litigation uh, that's going on. Little Rock's Fraternal Order of Police isn't saying much, pointing to this civil rights lawsuit. Chief Humphrey filed it in September, naming the FOP as part of a conspiracy to get him out of office. That came after five lawsuits were filed against the police chief by several employees who claimed retaliation and harassment. In order to ensure there's a fair process for both sides, we're, you know, we want to refrain from making any public comment on that. It's not all about Chief Humphrey. It's not all about his integrity. It's about these people conspiring against a sitting chief. Leaders of the Black Police Officers Association made that case during a recent city board of directors meeting, arguing the chief is challenging the status quo. Reform is coming. Reform is here. The old way of policing is gone. Meanwhile, the FOP has faced criticism that its leaders want to clear up. The Fraternal Order of Police is absolutely not a racist organization. Both sides now waiting for the process to play out in court. We have to make sure that uh, integrity uh, is at its highest level uh, because of the job we do. Honestly and truly allow people, the chief, to do his job. The city board of directors is still weighing the vote of no confidence in the police chief. That's supposed to come up at its meeting at the end of the month. In Little Rock, Susan O'Corey, back to you.